How's it going, everybody? This is Flint from Flint and Steel Survival bringing you an exciting video today. This is my custom Flint and Steel Survival cap tack um, hat clip. It is made of Kydex. Let's pull this off real quick. It's really not hard. I just made it look hard. Oh man, I'm throwing it around. So there's my logo. I chose red and black. Um, underneath you'll see CapTac USA, their logo. Um, this is the patent pending. This might be the design. I don't exactly know what those numbers are, but way cool. So they printed it on white Kydex, custom printing. And, you know, I've worn this for four consecutive days working in a machine shop. You know, I got it Monday. So, of course, I wore it on Monday. Um, I just threw it on my black plain starter hat. I wanted something that didn't take away from the, you know, like I have brown hats or sports teams and all that stuff. But I figured just a plain black hat would make this look the best. So I've been wearing this hat since. Um, and what's cool is I ordered two. Here's my two. And I got sent a third one because they said this one didn't meet their strict quality control standards. Now, I tell you guys what, I'm a guy that loves a puzzle, but I looked and looked and looked and then looked a little bit more and then kept looking, looking for just anything on here that would have failed a quality control test, because that's my job is quality control, and I think I finally found it. So if you look at that edge right there, crisp, clean, sharp, this one, I don't know if it got knocked or ground weird. But there's a little flat there. So that's the only possible thing I can think of. But I'm telling you what, that doesn't matter to me. That's the one I've been wearing. Um, these go on real easy. So as you can see, it goes like that. Just slips right on. Um, I've gotten a few compliments on it already. It's definitely something that people notice. You know, they wonder what you're wearing on your hat. For me, I tried... You know, I've tried the bullet, I've tried the fish hook, and I just didn't care for them, you know. I don't know what it was. The bullet just looks ridiculous. I'm sorry, guys, it just does. The fish hook at least looks good, but um, it always would fall off for me. I don't know, I guess I whip my head back and forth too much or something. But this thing, I don't really see it out of my vision. I wear my hat pretty low. I mean, if I'm really looking for it, I can see it. But it's not like it uh, impedes my vision. But, um, starter. Great product, guys. Um, I'm going to send this video to the uh, owners of the company. Because I messaged them, you know, giving them words of encouragement. Hey, it's great to see a small business. These are made in America. This is their original idea. They're making something out of it, and you know what? One day, that's what I hope I can do with something, you know? I just need to have a brainchild first or something. But I wrote them a quick message, you know, saying, awesome job, keep it up. You know, small businesses, it's it's a hard knock life, man. Um, I've known some people that have smaller businesses, local things, and it it's doggy dog out there. And I just thought I'd stop by and give them a couple, you know, nice words. Um, and they said, because I told them I was going to post this on my channel, and they said, link them the video because they want to see it, and they wanted positive and negative. So, I wanted to think of something negative, some improvement they can do, and literally the only thing I could think of, if you guys ever want to sell these on shelves, other than putting them in a bag like this, like if you wanted to go out to a store and see one of these on a shelf, what you should do is, it's going to be real simple. They have hole punches for um, badges. You're going to pop a hole, like right here in the center somewhere, of the card. Not, not Of course not your hat clip. Of the card, just pop one of those badge clip holes in and slide that through it. Um, and then just, you know, drop a hole punch through there. And you can hang this right on a shelf. So maybe it could be behind a counter. You're not going to want somebody walking off with your nice hat clips. But um, that's just a thought I guess I had. Um, but yeah, quality outstanding. Um, 
I haven't seen anywhere on this at all. The graphic I gave them turned out perfectly. I don't see any blur. You know, it's real crisp, real clean. Colors are really nice. Um, yeah, all around impressed. Please go check these guys out. Another thing they're doing, other than hat clips, is they've got Molly compatible. They're basically like a morale patch that you can clip on your Molly webbing, and it goes through a single loop of webbing, um, and it goes through. Let's see if I can draw it real quick. Failure. Let's see. Here. Then you can have something to watch. So it looks something like that. And um, the logo goes on the front. And you, this is a pivot point, so this is probably a hinge of some sort, maybe just a pin straight through. And it clips in here, so this is where it clips. Um, so your image is going to be here, and this goes through the back of the webbing. I mean, this is a really poor design, but those are called the clips, I'm pretty sure, I want to say. And then they also have something new coming out, which is called sticks. So small company, they're based out of Arizona, at least that's where it's shipped from, um, so please go support them, I saw this on Superfly Fat Guy's channel, he got some of their, uh, already made ones, you know, like the Don't Tread On Me stuff, and Sheepdog, he got a Sheepdog, I think, but I walked, I went over there, and I was gonna get just, you know, one of their pre-produced ones, and I saw that they do custom, so you can do either style, the clips, the hat clips, or the molly clips. Um, you can fully customize them. Uh, yeah, I think that's all I got. So thanks everybody for watching. I appreciate you. Um, cap tag. So go to their website. I'm sure it's on here. Yep. CapTac.co. Everybody go check out captac.co. You're definitely going to find something you like, and if you don't, you can definitely make whatever you want. Um, thanks, everybody, for watching. Have a great day. Bye.